What up, guys? It's your boy Dreamer here. First things first, I'd like to welcome you to this episode of this Road to Redemption series. Now, I know this isn't your average episode, and uh, where you know I have gameplay in the background, and I mean, you guys are listening to me narrate or just talk over it while you guys are watching the gameplay going on, you know, watching me score goals, doing my thing, whatever. But um, I thought I would make this episode because a lot of people seem to be confused about what this Road to Redemption series is, so I'm here to, you know, fully explain that and let you guys know exactly what's going to be going on in this series and how the gameplay and things like that are going to play out. So, um, first things first, the Road to Redemption series is a series where we take players who were young and everybody thought was going to do big things, like, I'm talking about best players in the world potential. Everybody thought that they were just going to be, you know, out of this world, you know, maybe not Messi, Ronaldo, but could be the next big thing. And um, for some reason right now in their career, they are not there, whether that's injury or whatever the case may be, you know, we're here to see if they can reach that full potential still. And um, as you guys know, in, in the series we're doing right now, in season one, we're doing Alexander Pato. And obviously we all know Pato's story and uh, pretty much what's going to happen in this series is right now we're in the first season that we're playing with Alexandre Pato. We are going to play through one full season into the summer of the second season, into the summer transfer window of the second season. Now our goal is to either have this player max out his potential in this first season that we're playing or by the summer of that transfer window, by the summer transfer window of the second season, that player gets an offer from one of the major clubs in Europe, rather that's uh, Manchester United, Manchester City, Chelsea, uh, Bayern Munich, Dortmund, PSG, Real Madrid, uh, Barcelona, AC Milan, Inter Milan, Juventus, whatever the club may be. Our goal is to see if that player can make it to be transferred to those clubs. Now, um, if that player does get transferred to one of those clubs in the second, in the summer transfer window of the second season, we will join that club and we will simulate to the end of that player's career to see if they grow at all. So like right now in the series, I believe Alexander Pato is an 82 overall. So by the end of the first season into the summer transfer window of the second season, if he doesn't grow at all, okay, that's fine. And if he gets an offer from a bigger club, we'll join the bigger club and then we will simulate to the end of his career to see if he grows even more. Now, if he stays an 82, even at his bigger club, by the end of his career, if he's still an 82, then obviously he did not reach his full potential. He could not reach the expectations that everybody had set out on him. And, you know, then we'll start a new season with a different player. And if he doesn't get a, if he doesn't get a transfer offer in the summer of the, uh, sorry, if he does not get a, tra a transfer offer in the summer of the second season, then we will play through the second season to see if he can reach that full potential by the end of that second season. Now, there's a player that I really, really want to do for this series, and obviously, uh, not obviously, but that player is Mario Balotelli. And Mario Bal Balotelli, as we all know, plays for AC Milan, which is already a high-powered club. They're not quite as high-powered as they used to be, but they're still a, high, a highly respected club in Europe. and. Obviously, our goal for that one isn't so much to get him to transfer to a bigger club, but to see if he can actually reach that full potential that everybody thought he could. And we will play through one full season with Balotelli. Hopefully, we can get some growth into the second season. Now, if he does, if he does get a transfer for a bigger team, like I said, we will accept that. We'll send him to the end of his career, and hopefully, he gets some growth. And if he doesn't, then if he doesn't get a transfer offer, then we will play through the second season. Hopefully, he does get some growth to see if he can you know reach that full potential that everybody expected of him and obviously we're aiming for you know mid to high 80s i'm not just thinking like 85 i'm thinking more like 87s 88s 80s not 89s maybe even 90s if we if we can really get the player there through whatever the means may be whether if it's training playing games scoring goals getting assists whatever it is and you know obviously the series isn't specific just to strikers it's to any players out there and in FIFA that we, that the world thought would be substantial players and they're not, and they're currently still playing football. So anyway, that's gonna be the end of this video. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. And if you liked the video, please leave a like at the bottom. If we can just get to 10 likes, 
just 10 simple likes that would be amazing i'll put out another video also and if you guys like the channel and are new to the channel please subscribe so you'll never miss an episode and uh, and i just want to say happy new year to you guys i really really wanted to put out an episode yesterday you know wishing you guys a happy new year but i couldn't because i was spending some time with some very important people in my life so i was unable to put out an episode yesterday but it's going to be up today and i would really like to wish you guys a happy new year and hopefully 2016 with or with 2016 comes everything that you guys hope and wish for and everything that you aspire to achieve and hopefully 2016 is better for you and your families than the last year was and thanks you guys have a great day enjoy the rest or enjoy the rest of this video and take care